Hi everybody, my name's Mark Wilde and I'm the Chief Executive Officer of Crossrail. It's my job to get the Elizabeth Line open. I'm sure everybody watching this, including me and my own team, are very disappointed that we didn't achieve the opening of the railway in December 2018 as we'd planned. It's disappointing because Elizabeth Line means so much for London, whether you're a homeowner, a retailer, are one of the many millions of customers in London and the South East that we have every day. It really matters, so we're disappointed we didn't achieve that, but now we're looking forward with certainty about how we will open this railway. I've spent the past four months doing two things. Firstly, working really hard at places like you can see here at Tottenham Court Road on finishing the work, but also I've spent the time resequencing the programme, reprioritising it because I realise what people watching this want is certainty about when we'll open the railway. And to do that, we needed to really go back to basics and build the programme up from scratch. So what's left to do in this programme? Well, the work's in two phases. Firstly, we need to complete the work in the tunnels. We need to hook all of the systems up in stations like this. And of course, we need to get the software ready for the state-of-the-art digital trains that our customers will enjoy. Those three activities will take us the rest of this calendar year to complete. We will then enter a trial running phase, which is a very intensive phase where we test the trains to their maximum capability. We shake all of the bugs out of the system and we get the railway in a situation of safety and reliability that our customers will expect. At the moment, we expect to open this railway at the end of 2020. Of course, we're going to try our very, very best to bring that as far forward as we can. And at this very moment, risks still exist that could make it go back. That window of uncertainty is really about the quality of the trial running, which we will get into in the early part of next year. Rest assured though, every person in my team is focused on making that date as early as possible. I know how important the Elizabeth Line is to London. It's my commitment to be transparent with you as we achieve key milestones and work through the programme, watching that window of uncertainty narrow over the coming months. The Elizabeth Line will transform transport in London, adding 10% to rail capacity and we'll all feel the benefit. I'm sure you'll agree that when we do commission this railway, it'll be sensational and it'll definitely be worth the wait.